Welcome and thank you for joining us at our Daily Bread Ministries for this evening's meditative podcast. Tonight we're reflecting on Psalm 139. As we begin, calm your heart by taking some deep breaths. Try to get as comfortable as possible. Today is finished. It is time to hand its joys and its burdens to the Lord. Come now as you are and surrender yourself to his mighty power and his love at work within you. Be still and dwell in his word of life and hope. Father, thank you that you truly know me. Help me to rest in your perfect love and knowledge tonight. Psalm 139 verses 1 to 4 says, You have searched me, Lord, and you know me. You know when I sit and when I rise. You perceive my thoughts from afar. You discern my going out and my lying down. You are familiar with all my ways. Before a word is on my tongue, you, Lord, know it completely. Does God really care about me? Have you ever asked this? Perhaps it's something that you've wondered in your heart, even if you've never spoken the words out loud. We often look in the mirror and see someone unlovable. And that affects our relationship with the Lord and our confidence in prayer. But Psalm 139 wants us to see ourselves through God's eyes, not our own. David wrote this psalm, reveling in the one key truth. You truly know me. From handmaking us in the womb to staying with us through every moment of our lives, The Lord is deeply committed to his people. There's nowhere you can go where he won't be right there with you. And there's nothing you can pray that he won't already hear it before it's left your mouth. Such knowledge is too wonderful for me, David wrote, overcome with awe and thankfulness. Find joyful fuel for your prayer life tonight as you meditate with David on God's perfect knowledge of his very precious creation, you. As we turn to prayer, breathe deeply, working out any tension through long, slow exhales. The presence of the Lord is a place of rest and peace. Do this breathing exercise to relax your body, refocus your heart and become aware of the presence of our Almighty God who promises to hear every word on our lips and in our hearts. Breathe in. And out.
Ansehen? Ansaut. Ansehen? Ansaut. Let's pray. Dear Lord, how wonderful to think that you personally formed me in the womb, that you dreamt up my existence and breathed life into my body and soul. I marvel that you care so much about me. Lord God, help me to see myself through your eyes. I am not a mistake, a random collection of molecules, or a result of my circumstances. I am your precious, deliberate, and intensely loved creation. Psalm 139 verses 13 to 14 says For you created my inmost being You knit me together in my mother's womb I praise you because I am fearfully and wonderfully made Your works are wonderful I know that full well Let's close with a final prayer. Heavenly Father, help me to hear the truthful promise in the words, your works are wonderful. I too am one of your works. So I too am wonderful because of you. Thank you, Lord for all the affirmation your word gives me. Help me to sleep in peace tonight, knowing you look on me with eyes of love. Amen.